Good morning, Jazzy Greens. How's everybody doing? I hope you guys are staying safe and I hope you guys are doing well. I'm doing good. This is Saturday morning. And of course I have my robe still on because I'm about to drink my coffee. But I just want to come on and say hi and I want to share with you guys pretty much how some of the parts of my house is looking since I took all the Valentine's decor down. Um, I haven't had a video up, you know, to share with you guys this whole week since Valentine's Day. And I'm sorry about that. It's just that I could not, sometimes I run out of ideas. And if you're a YouTuber, you know how it is. I absolutely could not think of anything to share with you guys. And I first thought about going into the stores and filming there, but I, um, I'm trying to stay away from the stores as much as possible you know, not go out so much and be around people, but that doesn't mean that I'm stopping. I'm just, you know, just trying to limit the amount of time and the, you know, the times that I go out. So I don't want to go out too, too much, but I will be hitting the stores, you know. We went grocery shopping yesterday and um, just to get some things for about a week or so, and I didn't haul it. Because by the time we got in, it was like, 6 30 almost seven o'clock at night and i have not eaten dinner and i don't like to eat dinner late i was rushing to sterilize and wipe all the packages down and wash all the fruits and vegetables before putting them in the refrigerator and i was rushing because i had to get my son's dinner together my husband's and mine together and i mean it was just no time to do a haul and you know i thought about doing one and i said i don't have time i'm trying to do this I had a headache so I was like <laughs> it won't be no haul this time and you guys have seen my hauls anyway it's nothing exciting but anyway yeah that's pretty much it let me go ahead and start this microwave and then move away from it do you guys start your microwave and move away or do you stand right in front of it I don't know, I don't know if that's safe to do or not. I was told that you shouldn't stand in front of your microwave um, because of the way the waves of it, you know, it can get inside you and probably, you know, I just heard it can cause cancer and things like that. But I don't know, have you guys heard of anything like that? So I don't know if it's true or not, but I just, I like to be safe and just stay away from it anyway. There's a tablescape that I just completed for next week. You guys will get a chance to see that, but I don't want you to see it now. But anyway, are you guys going to get the uh, vaccine? It's up in the air. Um, it's controversial to a lot of people, but I'm still, I mean, I'm praying about it. I don't know. I think hubby's going to pretty much follow me. He said he wasn't going to get it, but then I told my brother-in-law um I may and I may not I don't know I'm in the middle so I told him I said I might I just don't know yet I'm just trying to give it more time and you know see if I want to get it or not I don't know but if you guys are going to get it comment down below and let me know if you're planning to get it but anyway who knows I may and I may not Okay, here's my mantle, and as you can see, everything is plain. I haven't put anything up here. I just left these two candlesticks uh, sitting right here, and I don't know why they're spread it apart. I think because I had them like that before, so I just left them there, because you know, spring is coming, and I'll be decorating for spring, so it's just like this for right now. And then down here, I just left the lanterns here that I had before. Um, they're gonna be probably moved, especially that red one, cause I don't decorate with red, not hardly, not for spring, but I just kept these here just for the meantime. And I'll probably be using the white ones, um, maybe, but that red one definitely has to go. And for right now, the deer is just sitting right there. So this is my coffee table. I just kept my bling sitting here with my peppermints in it. Seems like I'm always keeping this here. I'm always, we're always reaching in here, grabbing a peppermint. 
but the peppermints normally stay in there and I may change them out and I might change out you know the bling I'm not sure the flowers I normally just keep the white in here but for some reason I want to just put a little pop of color so I just put the pink in there I think that looks pretty and of course my decorative box where we house our remotes that's the little one there I have a bigger one it goes across this way because it can't fit this way what I might do I'm thinking about jazzing this little box up uh, it's nice but it's too plain I'm thinking about putting some bling wrap around here or some kind of way but I think that'll look nice if I do that but I got this box on Amazon and of course I've got to do some dusting and uh, wiping off all my glass pieces so this is how this area looks right here the couches are plain as usual I haven't done anything to them yet and this is the side that hubby sits at <laughs> he normally sits here so I just have these two white pillows they're always here but um in the near future I want to get rid of these brown couches guys I don't know what I was thinking when we first bought this couch, these two couches. I wasn't thinking because I don't like brown uh, as a rule, you know, for furniture. So, you know, it's time to branch out. I want something white or off-white, maybe like a color like this. This is more like, it looks like an off-white beige, tan, whatever you want to call it, but it's in the white family, so that's what I want to do. I want to get some white furniture and get rid of all this brown. Ooh, this brown's got to go. So that's what that's looking like. And of course, the wall, I still have my decor wall pieces, candle holders right there. Okay, over here in this corner, I still have this arrangement here with my little lantern sitting there. It probably won't stay, but it's there for now. And on my little console table, I just have this cute little flower thing here. And don't mind the TVs on, I'm watching the news. <laughs> I just kept this little greenery here. It's just temporary. It might stay and it might come up, I don't know. And a little greenery over here on the edge. So that's pretty much how this is looking this gold vase with these flowers that will stay because i always keep that there i think it's so pretty these two red pictures on the wall um i usually you know that's they're up here now i'm not sure if i'm going to change those out um i may move them but they're so pretty i love these pictures and this little floral arrangement thing here i may move it you know change it out not sure I've got some black glass uh, not glass and black bowls sitting there because I was taking down a table state re recently and I you know I didn't have a place to put them so I just put them right there on the floor so I'll be picking those up and you know putting them where they got to go so not much done to the kitchen um, <laughs> these got to go I just sat them there don't even know why I meant to move them and put them away but my apples I know I'm gonna keep them here um, they will probably be changed out when I get ready to decorate here's my fruit basket because um, I love to eat bananas and all my oranges my, these are faux um, I have a faux orange and a real orange <laughs> as a matter of fact this one here that's faux I've got a full lemon and doesn't it look real? It looks so real, you can't tell. I've got a full apple. This one's uh, not real and there's some full grapes there. And I think, wait, yeah, these are full too. I almost thought that was real, see? But anyway, that's gonna stay there. Wash your hands. I mean, I be telling my son this all the time. He's 18, he thinks he know it, knows it all what do they know but over here is still um just simple here i don't know what's going to change out here but these are my apothecary jars i didn't haul these guys i meant to show you 
show you these when I first bought them. I bought them over a few weeks ago and I never hauled them, so sorry. But anyway, as you can see, one doesn't have anything in it. And just, just for now, until I get ready to decorate, they're gonna stay here. And I just added the little peppermints in there. And uh, the last of our candy canes in that tall one there. Over here, just temporary. Let me move this out of the way. <laughs> Black pepper. You don't need to see that. But anyway, here's my white tray that houses my my blessed sugar canister. Hubby uses sugar in his coffee. I don't put sugar in my coffee. I just use cream and that's it. And our hot chocolate is still there with a little cross. I don't know why that's sitting there. It's just there. And I might use it for when I decorate for spring and Easter. I mean, that would be perfect for Easter anyway. And, of course, here's my little um, bling thing that I put my stirs, my coffee stirs. You know, I'm looking for a cute little decorative something to put these in. This is cute. I think this is cute, but it's not... It's not really, I'm not feeling it. Because sometimes when I put them in here, they go down, they slide down, they don't stay up. So I'm looking for something, something different that will, you know, really look nice and stand up in there real good. So I'm on the hunt for that. I'm probably going to look at, uh, look on Amazon again. I looked on there before and I didn't see anything. So anyway, that's, the plain look of how this looks for the time being. And I don't know if I showed you the um, china cabinet. Nothing spectacular about this. I have some of the glasses in here that are missing because I have them on a tablescape that I'll be sharing with you guys very soon. So um, this is how it looks so far. I mean, I always keep my china in here. It stays in here all year round pretty much so I don't know if I'll be changing anything out in here I may may not but it normally you know it normally stays like this throughout the year but we'll see okay the entryway is still pretty much the same I've got my candlesticks on the wall my bling candle my greenery and that little uh, little plate there with the um, peppermints and down below are those little decorative balls there. But everything's pretty much the same. Okay, this is my office and everything is pretty much the same as far as the couch and the window treatments are. I just have my um, stick there, the um, tripod. And those dishes that are sitting there, I just can't seem to find a place to put them. I tell you guys, I need my own storage room just for all my decor because I have most of my stuff in the garage and boxes and I get so frustrated looking for things and you know those are things that I had taken down so I just had them sitting on the couch for the time being and my little picture there with me and my daughter and my son that's a long time ago I have that still there nothing has pretty much changed I don't normally change out um too much of my um you know rooms out too much the window treatment there is still the same i did change it out but i don't change stuff that often well, that's why you haven't seen a video because i couldn't think of anything to put up so anyway i'm gonna go ahead and finish up with this coffee and go ahead and um edit this video and try to get it up to you guys before it gets too late okay so anyway i want to thank you so much for watching and i'll be talking to you next week because i have a new video collaboration coming up on tuesday so you guys want to stay tuned for that and then i have another collaboration uh on the 26th because you know with this month being february and there's so many things going on black history valentine's day heart health and also a very very important day for me because february the 26th is my birthday <laughs> yeah anyway i'm just playing i mean it is my birthday on february the 26th so you know i'm excited you know 
God is blessing me to be alive for another year. So I am grateful for, for that. So stick around for that video coming up also on Friday, okay? So anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great weekend and I love you. Talk to you later. Bye.